Hello and welcome to this Blitz video tutorial on the ASCP uh, pegging problem. So if you stand in the planner's workbench, one of the age-old problems is that, uh, as you can see, uh, the different uh, demand and supply types here, um, you are unable to see the pegging on the same row. Very often the, uh, the customer of uh, planning would like to be able to see these uh, pegging information so that they can make more effective uh, decisions and so if you were to export this uh, planner workbench using the uh, standard export uh, it would not include this pegging information here so in order to overcome that we could create a simple um, blitz report and uh, you know apply some sql that would retrieve both the um, product demand and supply information together with the pegging. So I've already developed this, uh, this SQL. It, it's something that's uh, relatively straightforward. Uh, I do it using um, an SQL developer. I'm not a developer. I'm just a functional consultant. Um, but I'm able to write uh, relatively straightforward queries like this one. Once you've tested it, and you're happy with the uh, with the, the SQL? You can drop it into the Blitz report. Here I am in uh, developer mode uh, rather than user mode. So I drop the SQL in here, <clears throat> and at this point I can save it. Uh, you can run it, and then it will send the outputs of this planning information to an Excel, which can be then uh, shared with users. Uh, in, in standard user mode. Uh, at this point, it will open up uh, all of the, the details. You can see here we've got the same information. Um, so my on-hand record here is pegged to the um, both the sales order, this sales order number here, three, line 3.1, and you see here there's another uh, on-hand row here that's been allocated or pegged to line 2.1 and then the balance has been pegged to safety stock. So we could just reaffirm that, go into the planner workbench just to make sure that uh, what we're seeing is correct. So we've got safety stock quantity of um, 25 pegged. We've got here you know, 35 pegged for the sales order and 40 uh, for the, uh, the, the remaining sales order, line 2.1, which is exactly per the Blitz report. Furthermore, you could go back into your Blitz. Um, you can then uh, add some usable parameters. So we do that using the setup form. Um, it could be that we want to assign it to a specific responsibility uh, or a particular user. Um, and if we wanted to define parameters, we would runtime parameters, we would add them in here. And then other things you can do is you could send the output directly to an email. Um, which would then uh, allow you to pick this up into your, you know, in the morning or in the evening, whenever you're scheduled to, to run it. Um, so that concludes this, uh, this little introduction to ACP Blitz uh, and pegging. 